can you report on that? I yep. guess, uh, how tough is a loss like this when you guys are chasing points and trying to get uh, above the playoff line? Yeah, no, it's, it's it's always tough. This is a, is an important part of the season, um, and the, and these next few games, making sure that we're pushing towards the end of the year with uh, on a positive note. You know, you want the momentum now, uh, but but you know, you're gonna have some hiccups. I think it was very good from us. We created a lot of chances, especially at the end, and you know they're really packing it in. They got a few fortunate flicks, touches that just put the ball away from us or uh, just put the ball into their favor. So um, it's obviously unfortunate, but found some positives and we move forward. How much is this weighing on you guys, though, trying to, to get above that line now? But some teams ahead of you. And, and the good thing is, I guess, everyone's kind of bunched together, so mm -hmm. you still have a good chance. Well, it's an experienced roster. I think we, we know what it takes to get in the playoffs. We've been in situations where it's not in our favor, uh, and we've been able to find a way through. Right? This team and this, uh, this organization has found a way through every single time, and so none of us want to be on that, uh, that first team that doesn't. So we're making sure that we will put everything forward. And like I said, we want to get on that run towards the end of the year, which obviously is creeping up on us. We want to make sure we're finding our stride, but we have to you know, correct a little few things in, in, in the back line, maybe in the midfield, and we've got to put, put, uh, put goals away. How do you play with the sense of urgency without pressing or, you know, getting desperate? You know, I think it's going back to the basics. You know, I've been on teams that have gone six, seven, eight games without wins and, and you're, you know, losing at home and it's just really down in the locker room and the morale is bad. It's, it's about going back to the basics. You know, go to what you know and do that as best as you can. And then you start getting the flare out and then you start doing other things and, and things start going your way. So get back to the bases, get hard to beat, making sure that we're solid in the back, we're solid in the midfield, we're solid even starts up front, you know, the defense does. And, uh, you know, find ways to get that ball in the back of the net, even if it's a, a touch, a tap, a deflection, whatever it may be, a little bit of luck goes a long way. And in, in soccer, is that balls come in bunches? I yeah. Mean, you know, as long as you've seen it. Like I said, we've, we've got so much experience in this locker room that, you know, this is obviously a very tough loss for us, um, especially it being at home, but we want to make sure that we go push forward. End of the year, we got to make sure we go on a run and, and find a way past that line. You guys have had a hard time scoring off of set pieces. Any insight on what the problem is there? I mean, good defense. Uh, just a little bit unlucky. I think we've gotten a few, a few just off the off the head going high rather than low and it's just unfortunate timing you know I, I don't think set pieces are easy in, in any way um, whether you're shooting on goal or, or, or putting a ball in the box it's a very tough thing to do when everyone's kind of got their own little plays so um, I, don't, I would rather score a million goals out of run of play than anything else. When the goal gets called off for Raul yep. um, what's the emotion like on the bench and sidelines there and what do you see on the, the, the emotions on the field change? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure still what they uh, what they called uh, offsides. I think they said, but um, you know, it's 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 difficult. That's a that's a goal that kind of pushes you forward, right? Gets right. you out of it a little bit. We're at home. We're up a goal. Um, it's it's tough. You know, you got to make sure that we kind of instead of got, dropping back and maybe get putting our heads down, we got to make sure that we step up and uh, try and find that next one. You know, almost like it is one's journey trying to find this, the next one. So uh, I think it's a little unfortunate. I, again, I didn't quite understand or see what they saw, which is fine, I guess. That's the way that our luck has run, especially mine. Um, but, you know, you have to get by it. Had to make sure we scored the goals that we missed. What is the mood in the locker room these days? I mean, you, like, is it, can you see it? Is there a sense of panic? Is there a sense of optimism? Is there, like, what would you, how would you describe it? I, I wouldn't go either way. I mean, I think there's there's confidence in that this team has talent and this team has experience and that the team is not going to give up and just let the season go. Um, I don't think that we're anywhere near that, nor will we ever be. Uh, there's too much experience. There's too much youth and, and exuberance and excitement. Um, there's too much... Uh, the coaching staff making sure that we aren't getting too complacent or too down on each other. I think you'll see a run come, and I don't. I, I have you know zero doubt that it's coming. You've been on teams that have Last gone on those runs. Down. You've been on teams that haven't managed to go on those those runs. Is there something that you can identify that, like mood wise, you you can sense those things coming one way or the other? Uh, mood wise is tough. I, I think it's just yeah. But like I said, this team doesn't give up in the locker room. This team doesn't give up on the field. You see it. I mean, look at the last you know twenty minutes. It was you know I've been on teams that the last twenty minutes is them keeping the ball in our own half. So this is not a team that gives up. I think that has been throughout the the legacy of this team, and, and you're not going to see it now. Thank you. Sweet guys. Thank you. Slide Danny in right where he was.